What's most interesting, I think, about being in the world of training future artists and the musicians of tomorrow is that we are in such an exciting and demanding time. The road to becoming a great performer, a great player, hasn't changed to the extent that it still requires incredible dedication. But the reality is that that's just the starting point today. Musical excellence, it begins with that. I mean, because without that, everything else that we're talking about doesn't matter. When you look at our history, and you look at the people that have taught here, and the, and the performers that have come through here, it is what we're about. things I think about all of this is that what audiences really want, and I learned this in the, in the symphony business, in the orchestra business, they want to be close to performers. They want to have a level of engagement and interaction. They want to be on the inside. It's that whole idea of being engaged with your audience before, during, and after the performance. The whole notion of community connectivity, what it means is that musicians are part of communities. They have something so important to bring as artists. It's a whole different way of thinking. Peabody now has a unique opportunity to actually be one of the first schools to say, we're not just going to offer this as a possibility to our students, we're going to insist on it. It's going to be built into their experience. We bring in really interesting cultural, artistic leaders that are doing innovative things from around the world. They come in, they do symposiums, we have a conversation, they interact with our students, and it's a great way of introducing into Peabody the incredible variety, actually, of creative thinking that's required to be successful today. And this is time you spend on your craft. A lot of it involves imitation, replication, things that we need to do to develop a musculature, right? And there's the rest of this wonderful time that we have in the world doing everything from reading things to talking to people to having our minds blown by ideas that are different. It's not enough to just play the music. You have to have a, a broader understanding of the world around you. Peabody is the oldest conservatory in the United States. But to me, what really gets interesting is to take that history and to think about we're rooted in this history, but we're also thinking very creatively and innovatively about the future. Peabody's future is actually tied to its founding. Because Peabody wasn't founded as a conservatory. It wasn't founded as just a music school. It was founded more really as a cultural center. I think of Peabody as being not just a place where people are coming to study music, but it's putting itself at the center of a national conversation about why music matters. It's really an exciting time to be a Peabody, and I invite you to learn more.